The town of Cass, West Virginia, was founded in 1901 by Joseph Kerr Cass, the vice president and co-founder of the West Virginia Pulp and Paper Company. In its early beginnings, Cass was a company town for those who worked for the paper company logging on the nearby Cheat Mountain. During its heyday, from 1908 to 1922, the mill would cut 125,000 feet of wood every 11-hour shift, resulting in over 1.5 million feet every week. An integral part of the mill's success was found in the railroad. The logs were brought by rail to the town, where they were prepared for use by paper and hardwood flooring companies throughout the country. The laborers, who worked in the mill or the locomotive repair shop, lived with their families in white fenced houses built in orderly rows on a hill south of the general store. Since then, the mill closed in 1960. In 1963, the state bought the logging railroad and converted it into what it is today, the Cass Scenic Railroad. Cass utilizes locomotives well known in the logging industry, the Shea, a type of geared steam locomotive that was patented by Ephraim Shea, a Michigan school teacher in the mid-1870s. The locomotive's design consists of a regular fire tube boiler offset to the left to provide space for and counterbalance the weight of a two or three cylinder motor mounted vertically on the right with a longitudinal drive shaft extending from the crankshaft at the height of the axle. These shafts had universal joints and square sliding prismatic joints to accommodate the trucks. Each axle was driven by a separate gear with no side rods. Because of its design, the Shea's tractive effort, compared next to normal steam locomotives, was much higher due to a higher ratio of piston strokes, not common on standard engines. Cass Engine 11 prepares its train for an excursion to Whitaker a four-mile, 800-foot climb from Cass at a ruling 9% grade at times. Looking on from the siding track is Engine 4, who will pair with Engine 5 for the climb to Bald Knob. The railroad's 50th anniversary was underway during the time of our visit, with a commemorative run to Whitaker on the exact day and time the first train ran, on June 15, 1963.
On board the train, we get the opportunity to listen to these shays work their way up the grade to Bald Knob through the scenic West Virginia mountains. Yeah. 
Whitaker excursion waits for our excursion to pass through the upper switchback before continuing down the mountain back to Cass.
Oats Run Creek, and we will pause here for the train to take on water as a light rain begins falling. Yeah, 
side and uh, feel free to enjoy the overlook. If you look hard enough, you'll see the satellite telescope down the green bench. Bald Knob lies at 4,700 feet, the third highest peak in the state of West Virginia. From the viewing platform, one can look for almost 20 miles into the state of Virginia. Right down. They probably never will. Engine 4 has already began its trip back to Cass, leaving Engine 5 to bring us back down the mountain. Thanks for joining me on this assault to Bald Knob on the Cass Scenic Railroad.